Well, step out my back door. Just another day of uh, beauty here. Kim shit, poison shit, harp shit. It's all harp over there. And they just spray and spray and it turns into a total whiteout. Just like that. And that's how they're covering their shit now. And there they go. Non non-stop. But they just uh, keep it covered up with the with the clouds permanently here on Long Island. If we get a little bit of blue sky, this is what it looks like before they chem it up. Every day. Every fucking day. This is what we live with here on Long Island. You can see it's already being covered pretty good over there. You gotta be, you gotta be quick. When they start spraying, the sky disappears almost pretty damn quick. That's all harp over there. It's towards harp. You can just see all their shit. It just turns into a whiteout every day. Every day. been filming this stuff for years. So I got enough footage to make 20 chemtrail movies. But it's getting tougher because they're uh, they're keeping it whited out. Just like this. All the time. Even the clouds are fake. That's another way of hiding your shit. I always seem to have one big ass dark cloud parked over my house. <laughs> clouds ain't clouds anymore, my friends. They're weapons. Our sky is a weapon. Our cell phones are weapons. Our Wi Fi's are, are weapons. They just install this big ass antenna over there. You can see it. I'll try to zoom in on it a little bit. Right there. This big, uh, that's 5G right there, folks. You want to see what 5G looks like? That's it. They're putting them up every fucking place. All Long Island's being wired. All my favorite places I go have one of these fucking antennas parked right over it shopping centers, the libraries, or even a restaurant, a Chinese restaurant I go to, got one parked right, right next to it. Uh, tell you, we're, we're, we're dealing with Nazis here, folks. And Bush was, in, uh, Trump was installed by the Nazis, the Bush Nazis, just like the Bush Nazis installed Obama. If you think we have anything like a democracy, you're, you're, you're sadly mistaken. Democracy is long, long gone since the Bushes took over this country. And it's been a good 70 years that these fuckers have been uh, running America. If you want to put a face on uh, on this, sh this shit that's happening right here in our sky, you just look at the Bushes. That's the face. The, fa the face of poison. The face of chemtrail. The face of uh, harp. You look... You look at the, their whole history with Tesla, and what do you think Trump was installed for? His, uh, his uh, uncle, John Trump, stole all the Nazi secrets. He was an MIT scientist, stole them and gave them to the CIA. They were never found. Almost half, half of his papers are totally missing, thanks to the CIA. Thanks to the Bush uh, crime family, who uh, 
are behind HARP, who helped invent HARP, who brought Tesla's uh, work and turned it into a nightmare for the people, against the people, brought down the World Trade Center. How do you think it was justified by HARP, the same fuckers over there, Brookhaven Labs, who are poisoning our skies now with chemtrails and mind control? <clears throat> they brought down World Trade Center. If you look at the geography, you look at the uh, the the physics, you look at the landscape, uh, where, all, where all these burned out cars were, on Vesey Street and the other adjacent streets, it's a straight beeline to Brookhaven Labs. They have uh, taken Tesla's so technology and turned it into a nightmare against the people. and. Uh, that was their little uh, performance for the world. Hey, see what we can do. We can dustify the world now. God knows what they can do with this technology. But it, it, it made, made a straight beeline for Brookhaven Labs. You look at the, uh, the uh, trajectory of uh, the path of the directed energy weapons along Bessie Street and the other streets and, and it, everything points straight to Brookhaven Labs. If you're a geometry person, your uh, coordinates and map reading expert, just it's all there. It all points to uh, Crime Central USA, Brookhaven Labs, and George Bush and his fucking criminal, criminal gang doing his shit to us. You can see all the weird undulated things going through the clouds there. Those are frequencies. That's all coming from HARP. You can see the piezoelectric shit over HARP. In a few minutes, it'll all be whited out. You won't be able to see anything. And that's what happens to us every day now here. Here on uh, Long Island. Hell Island is what I call it. Okay. I just thought I'd go out and, and film it before it's a total white, white out as usual. We don't get sun. I feel like a fucking mole living here. It's always like this. Every single day. It's a total whiteout. Well, I'm going to go back in my little torture chamber at my apartment here get hit with frequencies every fucking day. There's a little church over here that uh, plays a nice little song with their church bells every every day at noon. Too bad the churches don't get off their pious their pious ass and do something about these fucking crimes that are happening in our in our skies. They're so religious and holy and care about the people so much supposedly that they can't get off their pious little ass and stop these crimes. If we had real religious people, they'd be stopping this shit. The MLKs of this world are gone. People who stood for something. Who actually did something. Anyways, I just wanted to make a little addendum. I, I, when, I, when I make a video, I like to state uh, where I'm at and when. It's uh, Long Island. June 8th, 2017. 
I've been filming these this chem trail shit for a long long time I've got so much video I almost kind of just quit putting videos out because I've got so much good video uh, put some good ones at the show and it, it hasn't stopped the only thing that has changed is they keep it covered I just I was just out here filming just a few minutes ago and uh, I showed how they were spraying and that they're turning it into an all white out and that's what you got here within within minutes it has completely been whited out it's a total bite out. And this is how they're hiding their crimes now, folks. And you better wake up. And you so-called churches, I believe in God, trust me. But God works through its people. Somebody said, uh, told their pastor, well, I'm just going to leave it in God's hands. And uh, the pastor said, well, why do you think God gave you two hands? Why do you think you have two hands? So people need to uh, get up and start doing something. Get off their little uh, religious, pious ass. <laughs> Excuse my language, but I have no other way of uh, describing uh, these crimes that are going on in our country and the criminals that are doing it. And if we had real religious men, men of faith, they would put their faith to work and they would start doing something to stop these crimes. This is for mind control. This is pure mind control is what all this shit is. And they hide it. 724. They're fake storms, fake fog, fake rain. We've had non-stop storms all frickin' winter and spring here on Long Island. Non-stop rain. Non-stop fucking rain from hell. Fake fog from hell. Fake snow. We didn't hardly get any snow this this winter. I think we got one snowstorm, and that was full of freaking chemicals and, and shit from hell. So, you know, I I don't uh, I tell it like it is, folks. And I'm sorry, these uh these so-called uh, uh, pastors, uh, people of faith better start putting their faith to work. Otherwise, in my opinion, you have no faith. And it even says in the Bible, faith without works is nothing. This is total for mind control, folks. They're using it all over the country. New York is one nothing, nothing but a, a mind control zombie land now. Everybody's uh, in planet with this nanotechnology. I get I get zombie attacks <laughs> everywhere I go. So anyways, I just thought I'd put out a video and people want to see the sky so uh, here they are. There will be more to come. I'm going to try to do more uh, and I'm definitely trying to uh, expose this mind control and that, that is uh, the biggest crime against humanity that ever existed in my opinion. And. Uh, these criminals should be uh, should be hung. Drain the swamp. I think you need to start hanging the swamp. Yeah, they're still still spraying up there. There's one little blue spot that they haven't totally whited out yet. This is this is a space-based technology, folks. If you think planes could just show up on command like this and white out a sky like this. Forget it. The, the planes and the drones, I believe, are being used for uh, for the nano dumps. Just the just the pure nano dumps. And but these are uh, the satellite-based technology that they're using to white out the sky is being used to hide uh, their frequencies and chemtrails. And I believe that's satellite-based. And uh, this is Star Wars technology, folks. 
They have mirrors in space, huge mirrors in space to beam this shit up with their laser guided directed energy weapons or whatever the hell you want to call them. And up into space and back down anywhere they want in the world. It's like a James Bond movie, but come true. And it's very true, folks. I live it every day. I wish it wasn't. Yeah, we have well, a little bit of blue left over there. And one other thing I wanted to add on this video is you cops better wake the hell up. You better wake the fuck up. They're mind controlling your ass like crazy out here on Long Island. They're doing they're doing it everywhere. But uh they're uh, I was going to talk to him about chemtrails, <laughs> but, uh, uh, yeah, you, uh, you, uh, people that, uh, the, the blue line, you're being mind controlled. You're, they're marching around like zombies. And part of this, this uh, whole agenda is pacification of our cops. I believe that's what's going on here. That's what I had somebody make a post uh, on one of my, uh, my YouTube videos that uh, this is a uh, this is genocide and pacification of the other law enforcement. That's with total mind control. Cops are being uh, turned into freaking zombies. I've seen it over and over and over again. I'll eventually start doing some videos more on this mind control. But uh, I wanted to add that you cops better wake the hell up and you better do something. Honor your oath. Your oath to the to people to serve and protect. What kind of protection is this? Poison every day. Please tell me what kind of protection you are offering to the people. You're not doing shit but collecting your paycheck and riding around like little zombies in your your donut mobiles <laughs> and harassing the probably uh, honest people. So anyway, I don't know. I don't want to get into that, but but the cops need to wake up. They need to realize they're being used. They're being mind controlled, like. Like you wouldn't believe out here on Long Island. We had, a, I was at Occupy Wall Street and we had uh, Suffolk County cops coming up to us at Occupy Wall Street stating that they knew they were being mind controlled. <laughs> so, so, so they know, some of them know. A lot of NYPD cops know what's going on with this mind control. Some people have eyes and ears. And they don't, they're not bought off by their paychecks and their, uh, their shiny badges. They actually believe in what they do. And some people are trying to do something, but very few, very few. And our politicians out here are so corrupt, so absolutely corrupt. I went to uh, my town hall yesterday to talk about these 5G antennas they are installing everywhere. I'll go uh, get a close-up of this 5G antenna they installed right outside my apartment building. But uh, I try, I try to go, go in and, and drop off some information about these 5G antennas because a lot of people are getting sick. People in my apartment building are getting sick. Uh, people, they're putting them in front of people's houses. Everywhere. I mean, your home is supposed to be <laughs> your castle. I don't think so. It's become a, become a torture chamber now. They can beam these frequencies right into your home. And they are beaming them into your home. They beam them into my home, I can tell you that. Uh, all my neighbors feel them. But it's military grade technology. And I try to go to the, the town hall. I'm not going to say which one. And it was like a freaking uh, Nazi, Nazi zone. 
like cops checking you in just a little town hall cameras everywhere cops at, at the main desk they want to see your photo ID they want your driver's license they they took wanted to take a picture of me wanted my name address everything I had to write everything down just so I could drop some information off with my supposed representative who the last thing he's doing is representing me. Look at this shit. That's 5G antenna. Installed right outside my apartment building. The frequencies coming out of this thing are fucking horrendous. Keep us running to the bathroom. And they, they put them all up and down this road here that I live on. All the places I go to, the shopping centers, the little restaurant I go to, uh, can't even go have a Chinese meal without being fucking beamed with fucking shit from hell. Right outside my apartment. This is military grade technology folks. It's 5G. It's a, they're slowly but, sh but surely turning it up on us. They're amping it up, just like harp. They're, they're slowly but surely amping this whole shit up. The frequencies out here have become ungodly. And they, were, they were ungodly under Obama. Now that we got the, the Trump harp man in there, who was put in there specifically because he is a harp CIA Trump piece of shit, the frequencies are, are 10 times worse. They're hiding them in the storms, everything. I mean, and you, you, you just walk outside and you just enveloped total frequency nightmare. And then with this 5G, they can really nail your ass. And that's what these are. These are weapons. These are weapons that are being installed in front of people's homes, in people's neighborhoods, and they can direct this um, five, this, this millimeter technology, military technology, at anyone they want. They can surveil you. They can attack you. They can uh, do a lot of things with this technology. And it's military grade technology, folks. And, uh, and our, our gutless politicians are allowing it. Our people are allowing this shit to happen in our skies. They don't get off their ass. Uh, they don't do anything to stop the chemtrails. You know? This, this, this is a bitch video. <laughs> Sorry, but I have, to, I have to make this. Because it's just becoming a total Nazi land out here. One little bit of blue, blue spy space. <laughs> They're working on that over there, you can see. It just turns to a total whiteout shitland. Just a few few minutes ago, I was over here. You could see there was a little bit of blue space, blue sky left. Nothing anymore. They're working on what little, what little, little blue sky we have left. They're working on it. <laughs> so it's it's a nightmare here, folks. All they can do is try and expose it and tell you what's going on. Uh, you know, somewhere people have to start to do something. People have to start to care. You know, there was a there was a there was a video put out. There's some Long Island residents uh, in Woodbury. They're putting up all these damn antennas all over Woodbury as well, and East Islip and. Okay, everywhere really. They, they want to completely roll out 5G by 2020. Can you imagine what a Nazi fucking place this is going to be with this shit? We're already being bombed with 4G. You can't go anywhere without your ears ringing non-stop. And then they get this 5G. Forget it, folks. Forget it. It's mind control on steroids. That's what this stuff is. This harp shit. These frequencies all feed into this shit. 
and it, it just turns our, our world into a fucking Nazi land. I'm, I'm sorry, I just don't, I don't mince words, I just tell it like it is. I live it. Every day I live this stuff. I, I, this is just one day. I live with this every single day of my life here. It's like this. I could do a video every day. There's some horror going on in our sky. It's always like this. It's always whited out. It's always uh, chemtrailed and poisoned out. And frequencies just start blasting like hell. And they're using it in, in the most ungodly ways. And we've got things happening all over the world. Moscow's being uh, bombed with storms. They're using it in professional sports, this mind control. I have no doubt about that. Everything's fucking... They can, if, if they can control your mind, they can control everything. It's as simple as that. They've been working on this technology for... Probably for, for centuries they've wanted to mind, be able to mind control people. And now they can. Now they have the technology. It's like Brzezinski said, it used to be a lot easier to control a million people than it was to kill them. Now it's a lot easier to kill a million people than to control them. And I believe that's part of this agenda, this depopulation. Slow kill with these frequencies, mind control. And they definitely want us mind controlled along the way. You're dealing with pure evil here, folks. Satanism, sat 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 satanic government. And that's what these people are. They don't flash satanic hand signs for nothing. They're all Satanists. Trump, Obama, Bush, <laughs> never seen so many satanic hand signs from him. Cheney, all these people. Just look on, look at, look it up. Look on the web. You have to be Satanist to do this to people. Install torturous frequencies right outside of people's homes. Well, I'm signing off. You can see what's going on. I hope. <laughs>